Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I welcome you to the broadcast of today and it's titled Father and Father. Right away, I want you to picture the plant. You know, the root has to go deeper and then the uh, stem has to grow uh, higher. So we can always aspire to go further and also go further. I'll read Genesis 1.28 again. It says, then God blessed them and God said to them, be fruitful and multiply, fill the earth and subdue it, and have dominion over the fish of the sea, over the birds of the hair, and over every living thing that moves on the earth. So they started with planting that uh, seed. But beyond that, God had already said that beyond planting, beyond growing, beyond harvesting, also think of multiplication, and also go further to subdue the earth, and also even go beyond the surface, of the, beyond what you can see as the earth, and even go and have dominion over the fish of the sea. So everything upon the earth, God placed it under the dominion of man, that we can always go further, and we can always go further. That blessing and that equipping God is giving to us, Amen. So the world has gone through different uh, 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 stages of uh, advancements, and we still haven't gotten to the end of it, you know. And uh, so because we can always go further and further. There's a story of uh, Prophet Elijah, and this was a man who prayed. The Bible tells us that, you know, he prayed, heavens were shut. He also prayed, and heavens were opened. And then he got to a point that this man of, uh, of great impactful prayer went and sat down and prayed a different kind of prayer. What was the prayer he prayed? He said, God, I'm tired now, I'm fed up. I don't want to go further. I don't want to go further. Just take my life. Oh, God, have mercy. You know, so sometimes that happened, by the way, when the Bible says that Elijah had walked virtually the whole day through a desert. That happens sometimes when we face death, desert experiences and everywhere looks short and we think that we have come to the end of the road. But when we come to that point, remember, we can still go further and we can still go further. Why? The Bible tells us while this earth remains, seed time and harvest will not cease. So we can, in the midst of what looks like a desert, throw a seed and plant again and sow again and make a new move, and make a new uh, step in order to sow again, because we can always go further, and we can always go uh, further. Praise the Lord. So the man who is down at the bottom today can get and can rise to the top tomorrow. It's a matter of, by the grace of God, seeking God's message, that as I sow again, as I plant again in hope, Lord God Almighty, bless this seed with a pleasant surprise from heaven. Praise God. Galatians chapter 6 verse 9 sums it. It says, And let us not grow weary while doing good, for in due season we shall reap if we do not lose heart. Bible says don't grow weary. Even though the circumstances around and the desert around is saying it's time to give up. The Bible says, don't give up because in due season, we will reap if we do not lose heart. Beloved, it's not time to lose heart yet. It's not time to uh, give up yet. Be, without doubt, the times we live in are challenging. Really, really challenging. Whether at home or abroad, they are challenging. But yet, there is hope that God in his mercies can bless the seed that we sow and cause us to rise again. You will go further, and you will go further. I will go further, I will go further. Amen and amen. We haven't reached our peak yet. We haven't reached the end of the road yet. Because even what looks like the end of the road, God can make a way right there. God will make a way for you. In the name of Jesus, pray this prayer and say, Father, as I look up to you, stretch your hand and raise me up again. Lord, stretch your hand and make a way in what looks like a wilderness. In Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen. God bless you. The Lord has answered you. I will hear your testimony. Join us again tomorrow. God bless you.